Hey, what's going on YouTube? I'm gonna put the camera up. Feel better, like holding it in my hand. Yeah, I'm not shaving for maybe a whole year. Just until I can get my reading back on track. I was able to do enough work last night. And things are slowly coming back to me. I know I'll be something in life, but with the whole OCD, sometimes it's just constantly in your mind. Like, you're not going to be nothing but a factory worker if you keep doing this or that. And it constantly just bothers me a lot. But, um... Speaking of people who work jobs that aren't really desirable, and this is not a diss, because I work a pretty unbecoming job myself. It was a guy who worked at Burger King for 27 years. And social media, I sound like a <laughs> I sound like a journalist when I when I say this. Social media reacts very they're, they're very unhappy with what what Burger King decided to give him as a um, as for his anniversary of 27 years, people were very um, discontent with how they awarded him for like they gave him a little care package of like candy. I forgot what it was all about. I saw like a, a minute clip of it. It was like candy in there, or, like soap or some or something like that. I remember when I worked at BJ's. For our hard work and dedication, um, our boss, my boss, Mike, he, he decided to award us with some Chick-fil-A. Now, I don't eat meat, but I thought he was going to bring like a catered, like like a, like he was going to have Chick-fil-A, like catered food to the job. Not exactly. He gave us, uh, it was like, it was, we, we were a staff of probably over 100 people. He gave everybody... It wasn't enough for everybody, but he just brought like a bunch of individual chicken sandwiches. It was chips in there, a small waffle fry, and a bunch of water that's already available for the for the staff. And that was our that was to show our hard work. So let me explain something first. Any job you work at, they are not responsible for caring about you at all that's why you don't you're never supposed to show any kind of allegiance to any job you're at at all you know it's good to work for somewhere 27 years where you can make sure you have food in your, in your stomach and you have your bills paid for that long period of time but it's nothing to to exhibit to the world like you you accomplish something because at the end of the day, when they fire you or you quit, you mean nothing to them. You know, you your spot can be replaced. Anybody can re be replaced at these jobs. But I don't feel like the job did anything wrong. Because let me just tell you from my perspective, I don't think a job should really be concerned about your well-being. You know, you're there to just work, make money. That's the only thing they could do for you is pay you your exact amount that you are owed and follow all the regular the federal regulations with the job, making sure you get a break, making sure you are um you know treated treated in a um respectful way and that's about it. But this guy got hundreds of thousand of dollars in donations. I'm not mad. Good luck to him. But it's a lot of things people aren't really aren't really questioning. Like for one, why was he at that job for that long period of time? Why was he at Burger King for 27 years? And the second thing is with all that money, he buys a house. How would he keep up with, you know, like the mortgage and the tax, the property tax? Cause it's like, you just, when you buy a house, if you can buy it and, and pay it off in full, there are a lot of there are a number of things you have to consider when buying a house. Like like when you when you don't have a um an apartment, there things are covered for you, but it's a lot different with the house. You know, with his kind of work that he does, would that will he be able to keep that house 
you know, or in like 10 years from now? These are questions you gotta ask yourself. But I don't think his job was wrong in giving him, you know, that, that little, like, be glad you got something, you know? Be glad they gave you something, but I don't think they were wrong in any way, you know? They gave him a job for 27 years and, you know, 